It's interesting in our society, you know, how we do things. You know, we plan for so many life celebratory events. We plan for a wedding, we plan for a baby, we plan for a graduation from high school, from college, we plan for our career. But the one thing that's guaranteed in life is our death. But nobody wants to take the time to plan it. I'm actually trying to get people to open up their mind and realize that death is a part of life. And just as you are making choices in life on how you want to live your life, you have those same opportunities to make those choices of how you want to die and, and how you want your funeral to be, what you want done with your body afterwards. I've come across many people um, during their dying day um, that basically have said, don't cry for me at my funeral, laugh, you know, share wonderful stories. And I, and I think that People are really trying hard to take the sadness out of the funeral as much as possible and trying to say, you know, celebrate the life I lived. Celebrate that I was actually here. A funeral is a time to, to, to mourn, to grieve. I'm not, I'm, not trying to, I'm not trying to take that away because that is very much an innate feeling that resides in us all and we all have to have it. You have to grieve, you have to mourn, but you can also celebrate and you can laugh and you can reflect and have memories. And so the funeral is that time to really just bring it all together. I embrace death. I, I deal with death on a daily basis. Um, and it's just, it is really part of who I am. And I know one day I will die. Um, and when I do, I wanna be cremated. And I want to, I want to do in death the same as I did in life. I wanna do as much as I can. I wanna be, um, half of my ashes will go to Arlington National Cemetery because I'm a soldier and a veteran and I want my great-great-grandchildren to be able to one day walk into that cemetery and say this was my great-great-grandmother and then the other half of me I want to just do as much as I can and I will leave instructions for my children uh, allow them to to keep a portion of me in a keepsake if they so desire if that's what brings them comfort um, I want to be turned into a diamond. I want to go into outer space. I want to go and become a coral reef. I want to be incorporated into a painting. Thankfully, my daughters like tattoos, so one of them could put me into their tattoo. <laughs> so I, I want to do as much as I can, and I'm hoping that I won't be dying for a while. And when I do, hopefully there'll be a lot more technology out there that has um, you know, come to the forefront, and there'll be more things I can do.